This Debaco University video is going to get into some of the details of the terpene pinning. All right, let's get into the terpene guide for pinning here. So looking at the scent location and properties of this particular uh, terpene. Now as the name kind of implies, we kind of can see it in the term, uh, it kind of has that pine or woody pinning kind of like a uh, scent to it. It's uh, found in basil and parsley, pine nuts, citrus fruits, can also be found in pine needles, and can be seeped in hot water and consumed as a tea. So this is not just unique to a cannabis plant, because it is commonly found in pine trees as well. Pinene actually comes in two isomers or types, uh, an alpha uh, and a beta. And the alpha, which smells like pine needles and is the most commonly found terpene in nature, kind of important fact there. And then beta, which smells like rosemary, basil, dill, or parsley, some herbs you might be familiar with. So just a slight change, you can see the double bond is located right here in the alpha, double bond is located up here in the beta, and that does uh, change the scent properties, uh, scent as well as other properties. So the medical benefits, just in general here, nice little summary. Uh, it is an antioxidant, so it prevents oxidation damage from other molecules in the body, an important aspect. Uh, pinene is also a powerful uh, bronchodilator, which helps improve airflow of the lungs for those that might be suffering with asthma. It also has anti-inflammatory and pain-relieving antimicrobial, antibacterial uh, properties. Pinene also crosses the blood-brain barrier, improving memory and alertness. It also may counteract some negative qualities typically found with THC. Now, if you're looking for what strains might be a little bit higher in this particular terpene, well, here is in general a uh, kind of a list here as far as to provide you with a starting point as far as some strains to look at, as well as another little summary slide here if you're looking at learning more about the terpene pinning.